Hey everybody. Um, I haven't been on YouTube for a while, like I haven't even been watching videos. Um, I know I, it's been a while since I've made a video, but I haven't even been watching videos. I, um, I opened up my account today and it looks like I've been attacked by a vote bot. Um, so, there you go. Um, so, if you want to go ahead and uprate my, my videos, you don't have to, but I don't know, it just looks kind of pathetic looking at my videos and seeing all those two and three star ratings. But anyway, <coughs> um, this video is actually going to be a response to P Witness, who made a response to my, um, my gay marriage video series. Okay, um, first of all, uh, P. Witness, you asked me, uh, what I meant by natural. You know, what, what does natural mean? What is natural? Uh, you know, because technically, technically speaking, you know, everything that occurs in nature is, everything that occurs in nature is natural. And, yeah, that's kind of true, but, um, what I mean by natural uh, specifically is uh, things that could not could not happen without human intervention uh, and yeah humans are animals and we are part of nature so therefore uh, anything that humans do is natural yeah but that's not really what people mean when they say natural um, it's anything anything that uh, does not require human intervention. So, that's what I mean by natural. And, uh, um, your second question about, uh, you were talking about the, uh, the gut feeling that you get with, uh, um, not, not just you personally, but any, anybody gets with, uh, bestiality, pedophilia, um, and other stuff like that. And yes, I do get those gut feelings. Um, but I don't base my morals on them. And there's a very good reason for that. The reason is I get that same gut feeling uh, from heterosexual sex. It's true. Um, and, but see, I'm, I'm uh, bombarded on a constant basis with heterosexual sex. So it's, it's sort of desensitized me to that. So I'm a little bit more open-minded when it comes to other things. Now, you said, uh, you know, what if there was no doubt that we were able to uh, confirm that an animal was able to give consent? Under, under those conditions, yeah, I don't think there's anything wrong with, be with bestiality. Um, as far as pedophilia, um, you mentioned, you know, if we could, uh, excuse the train, as far as pedophilia, you mentioned, um, you know, if we were somehow able to, uh, uh, you know, have a child, uh, you know, understand the concept of sex uh, and uh, be able to give their consent, uh, would that be okay for me? Um, that alone by itself, no, probably not because I think there's, there's also a maturity factor that comes into play, but if we were somehow able to get past that maturity factor as well, then really, once it comes down to it, that's not really a child. Um, you know, if they're mature, then they're not a child. They're just a small human being. Um, so I, I think it's, it's, the, it's the, uh, the maturity factor that's the uh, that's the uh, the main point in that. If there was some way, I, and I don't think there is, if there was some way to get around the whole maturity issue, if there was a way to get around that, uh, making the you know without making them an adult, um, then I suppose yeah, I would be fine with it, but I don't think that there is a way to get around that. You know, I mean, even hypothetically speaking. Uh, anyway, so that's my response, and uh, thanks for the video response.
and I will see everybody later. Adios.